enjoying a nice little night mush here. It's just on the mountain close to our house. It's got a nice fresh dump of about four or five inches of snow in about an hour. <laughs> and so uh, finally it let up. It's no longer hit me in the face with piles of snow. And now we're getting a good hill workout with some nice fresh snow. We're gonna climb up about 2,000 feet going up this little rise and then come back down. And today's a warm up run, so we're not gonna overdo it. Just want a, a short but nominally intense run. Tomorrow we're gonna start a big old series and probably be back up and down this mountain a few more times. So I've just got 11 here today. Um, got a couple more teams of dogs that were going out earlier and another one going out later. And I've got a whole bunch of dogs we're working with, but I've had a real tricky time trying to get this down to the to the 16 that I can really focus on and then ultimately pick my 14 from that gang. So that's kind of been the goal is to get that core group of 16 figured out so I can really put my focus and attention on those ones and I'm getting pretty close. And then we've got a great a great B team set up. So if I pick a little bit wrong, uh, it's not like they're out of the running by any means. They're still active and doing almost as intensive training, which for some of the older dogs and younger dogs is possibly even more ideal do a little bit of that lighter training and they can always rotate back up into my main core group but this is gonna be a tough year to try to pick 14 to start the Iditarod with just a very deep talented group of dogs the old guys are still seem to got to have it they're just doing great the young guys all seem like they're uh they deserve a spot as much as anybody so it's really hard to make any decision on the flip side, it's a good problem to have, and I don't think there is really a wrong choice. So, anyway, beautiful night for a mush. It's about 30 degrees out, so I can actually take a little video without freezing my hand or my phone. <laughs> um, I was a little bit miserable there for a while when we had just tons of snow pouring down and hit me in the face. But now that that's stopped, it's just a beautiful night. Isn't it, boys? Ha, <laughs> ha.